John, I apologize. I'm technically challenged. I didn't mean to cut you off. We were talking about the Oregon Ducks, and, and you were talking about peeling it off if you want. So, John, does uh, you put air conditioning in this car? Yes, it's a really good air conditioner. It's, it will freeze you. <laughs> It'll freeze you out? It's controllable. And yeah. It has uh, power brakes. Okay. Do the back windows go up and down, or they're fixed? No, they're fixed. But you have power front windows. Yes. Okay. And the front windshield, uh, you can. It uh, tilts out. Okay. John, is there anything in closing that you want to say about the car or, or, something? I was noticing that the cowl where it meets the uh, windshield is is molded in. Is that how they came normally? No, I I, I welded all that up uh, because Model A's were built kind of move. They had a lot of rivets. They were made of separate panels. Model T's were even more so. You can take a Model T down to the riverbed and you can drive it and you can see the body twist. And the Model A's were a little more rigid, but they were made of separate panels. So all of that's been welded up because it's on a much, much stronger frame. Model A's frames were built to move. And then also with the suspension I have, with coilovers on front and back, the car, you know, it reacts uh, in a much more smoother way. Okay. Um, well, I, I unless there's something that you wanted to add, I think we're we're kind of at a a draw right here. Um, the car is absolutely beautiful to be sitting in front of, and and then to hear you talking about how you came up with the roof line and and the different items. Well, this is a really drivable car because it has the suspension, the TCI suspension. You can put it on the highway and it doesn't rattle, it doesn't squeak. If you go over a bump, it doesn't pop and snap. It's just really a solid, solid car. How many miles have you put on the car? About two, three hundred? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you two, just Two or three hundred. You've just barely it. broken it in. Yeah. Have you done a recent oil change or anything, or just? It's got the original uh, break-in oil in it. Yeah, we could probably change the oil, you know, a little, in another 500 miles. Yeah. But I was. No reason to. I haven't uh, driven the car that much, only enough to make it make it really nice. Who did the wiring loom? I, I did all the wiring. All right, good. All right, John. Well, listen, I appreciate your time with us, and uh, hopefully the. Uh, this will work for the next owner and, and everything will go very well. All right. Thank, Thank you, John. You.